So, okay. So, January to like March, April, I was like really bad. Because, okay, long story short, I have OCD. And I I need a trigger warning for these, right? It's not, I'm not gonna like, I'm not, I'm not gonna say anything like crazy. I'm just gonna tell you like where I've been. Like, I'm just like, but like plainly telling you I have OCD. And January to like, let's say April, I was having a really hard time, really bad episodes. And then I like, since then, like around beginning of April, I like really kicked it up a notch of like my therapy and sorry, I burped. (laughs) My therapy and also like I finally started like I got back on meds kind of thing like steadily since April until now. Uh, so yeah, I'm so much better now. I'm I'm good. I'm fine. I told you I don't want. We're not gonna like. I don't. I don't want to like have this like a trigger warning something like it's plainly. I'm just telling you that's where I've been. <laughs> this is where I've been. We're gonna talk about the good things, the happy things. Um, things I've been learning, and then you can just guess what like. What, what the scary bomb is. I was like, whatever. It's like, what I've been, like, things, what I can think of now is like, to talk about is, are things that I have been trying to relearn. Because you have to understand, like, when my OCD flared up the past couple of months, it was literally like, I was completely sort of like, I was bedridden. Like, I could not get out of bed because I was that scared of like, all the things, whatever, et cetera. We're not going to get into, right? Um, I'm gonna drink water. Pause. Pause. Everybody. Drink water. 